The sun rose and work began. Word of a better day spread throughout the people. A day free from bondage. This hope carried them through their labor. They knew their God was faithful, that he had a plan, one to set them free, to a land promised by God to his people, for his people, a plan of redemption, but they lost focus. Turned away from the God who was faithful, worshiped false idols, turned back to the very culture God was rescuing them from, turned back to their past, to bondage. So they wandered and wandered. They began to grumble and curse the God who rescued them. They would never set foot in the land they were promised. They would never be unleashed. But God's plan perseveres despite the disobedience of his people. He waited for a new generation to rise up from the dust, one that would step out from their wandering and into the purpose for which God was calling them, to be a nation set apart that would bring glory to him. He continues to call those courageous followers out of the desert, away from our wanderings, to be God's representatives here on earth, to be unleashed from the bondage of our past, unleashed from being brainwashed by culture, unleashed with the backbone to lead the church, unleashed with the boldness to serve the world, unleashed for the gospel. He calls his people to be unleashed.